Gentlemen, how are you? All right. Well, we dialed up October for you for the weather. I think it came out all right. So, my name's Pete Swisher. I'm the superintendent with the National Park Service here at Herbert Hoover National Historic Site. It is an honor to have you here. We're, we're really glad and very excited to see so many people turned out. It was fun to see the, the National Championship Hoover Ball happening over here, so that was fun. Uh, we've had a good day. We've had a great day celebrating uh, Herbert Hoover's 150th birthday, and uh, we hope you've all been enjoyed all of the activities that have happened uh, in the library museum, over in the National Park, on Main Street, you know, all the activities that have happened, and, and so we hope you've been able to take in as much of that as possible. Our partners with the fire department, our partners with Main Street West Branch, Hoover Presidential Foundation, and of course, the Presidential Library. So, and I want to congratulate the uh, newly formed uh, uh, Hoover Hometown Days Committee because as you know this is a citizen driven group and they help make this event happen for us this year so uh, first time right out the gate and I think they really killed it don't you think so we're gonna get ready going here, but uh, before we do that, I wanna introduce uh, the executive director of the Hoover Presidential Foundation, Mundy McCarty, for a couple of words. Welcome everybody, I'm Mundy McCarty, uh, President and CEO at the Hoover Presidential Foundation. So glad to be here as a partner of the National Park Service, the committee putting together hometown days, the city government, the national uh, historic site, the park, the library and museum, etc. So we are grateful for your attendance at this spectacular opportunity. I think our next task is to celebrate the Hoovers on their 150th birthdays. So we would love you all to uh, get your lungs ready and uh, help us sing happy birthday to Bert and Lou Hoover. And here we go. Pete's going to join me. We're not terrific singers, but ready? One, two, three. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday. All right, sorry I put you through that, but. All right, so in just a moment, we'll do a toast. I want to tell you a little story about uh, Herbert Hoover. You know, he enjoyed a martini once in a while and uh, used to have a couple of them a day, but as the years went on and he uh, started to have a few health problems, his physician told him he needed to cut back on the number of martinis he had every day. So he asked his staff to make the glass larger and he only had one a day, so. All right, so. With that, do you have anything else you'd like to add? You think you're good? Okay. So we're going to get out of the way. You've seen enough of us all day today. I thank you again. Really, really, really appreciate your attendance here tonight. And I want to tell you, it is a very special and patriotic honor for us to welcome the United States Air Force Shades of Blue group here. And uh, folks, this is an amazing group. Tag them on social media. Get the word out that you were here and that you enjoyed their show. We are honored to have them. So thank you very much. Enjoy the night and uh, happy birthday.